Okay, right, Tiffany, thank you. The tight-knit community of Berea College being dealt yet another blow this morning. Less than a week after a terrible car crash took the life of one of their own. The Fayette County Coroner says a second student involved in that wreck off Walnut Meadow Road has died. LEX 18's Claire Crouch has details on a second arrest and reaction from fellow students. A noticeable change on campus. It's been like pretty, pretty somber, you know. It's quite different than it was the first couple of months before it. After now, two Berea College students have died as a result of a suspected DUI crash. There's a hole, there's, there's something missing, and it's, it's very noticeable, yeah. Nakajayan Inkbold, known as any by friends, was one of several Berea College students involved in the nasty two-car crash off Walnut Meadow Road Friday night. Police say 23-year-old Johanna Ivanova died on the scene Inkbold passed away just last night. I, honestly, it's like heart dropping. Like I just like hearing that, you know. The night of the crash, officers arrested the driver of the car the students were in. That man, Daryl Long Foster, is now charged with DUI. But with the news of Inkbold's passing came yet another arrest, Natasha Gross. She is now charged with two counts of second degree manslaughter, wanton endangerment, criminal mischief, and operating with a suspended or revoked license. Officers say she was in two different crashes Friday night before the one that claimed two lives. Covering the news in Madison County, Claire Crouch, LEX 18 News. Claire, thank you. Now at 5.06.